Back everyone. Well, if there are two things we in the tri-state know, it's good brew. Had to have a bit of a laugh on ourselves. The Cincinnati Brew Ha Ha is back at Sawyer Point. 50 comedians, more than 100 beers, thousands of jokes, and Josh Sneed is a local comic who will be headlining tonight. Josh, welcome. Well, thank you, Bob. It's good to see you as always. Good to see you too. Uh, slightly, there, there's twice the number of beers as comedians. What does that mean? That just shows you uh, we want to cover all of our bases at the event. So uh, it's a it's a really amazing event. I'm happy to be a part of it for I want to say eighth the eighth year now. Um, but it stretches all the way down from the tunnel underneath the Purple People Bridge up to the main area of uh, Sawyer Point. There's four comedy stages, like you said. There's 200 kinds of beer. Yeah. Uh, it's free to get in. About you obviously that. have to pay. You have to pay to drink. Sure. But uh, but the mission to watch the comedy and walk around is free. It's uh, it's really awesome. It got voted best local festival last year nice. in uh, City Beat. So uh, we're very proud of that. And. It's going to be a good time. That's why we added another day. As I say, we're, we're seeing some video now, and i got to imagine for a guy who is from here, to see an event like this have the success it has had and, and probably get talked about in national circles as well, that's got to be pretty cool. It's very cool. Um, you know, Cincinnati it wasn't always a place where you heard other uh, comedians and headliners talk about a place that you have to go, but this event has uh, gained such popularity in the comedy community that a lot of big-name comics who have done it um, have told us, you know, like, how do I get in there? How do I come back? Oh, wow. And, uh, and that's, you know, again, that's why we're adding another day because it just, it's taken off beyond anything that, uh, that we initially thought it would. And, and it's great for me from being from here to see that kind of popularity and, and see how excited that not only the headliners that want to come in who have never been here, but also the comedians who are from here, sure. they sort of look at it as like their yearly homecoming and you get to see some familiar faces. Well, we talked about that a little bit during the break. Is is it easier or harder to play in front of the home crowd? You know what I mean? For me, it's a little bit uh, harder, a little more anxiety, uh, just because I've, you know, I've been doing stand-up here for uh, 17 years now. So, in my head, I always have that people have seen me a lot, and and I want to make sure that I have enough new material whenever I do perform here. But this event is just so awesome. The people are so awesome. The crowds are so responsive. I mean, when you talk about a, a comedy show that's happening outside with lots of beer involved, <laughs> it doesn't sound to a comedian like it's going to be a great How environment. How can that work? Yeah. Right. But it but it always is, and the crowds are are great and respectful, and they laugh. And and again, it's just a testament to to why it's grown every year, especially this year. Do you change up your act at all? to play to things that people here get that people elsewhere wouldn't. You know what <laughs> I, I mean? used to, yeah. and I, I probably will a little bit, but I used to a lot more because I, I would perform here a lot more. And of course, living here, I, I you know, this is the only place that I could do those jokes. Sure. Uh, but when I'm writing material, I try to write stuff that I can use everywhere. Uh, but, you know, thanks to a, a, a marriage and a three-year-old, the, the material seems to be flowing pretty, uh, There's plenty pretty there. well right now. There's yeah. plenty there. I have to apologize. I mean, I always, I always dress. I never feel dressed up enough like you guys when I'm here. Look, I think you look outstanding. Well, they say dress for the job you want, right? <laughs> Not the job you have. And so, so this is, this is a the, the Costco look. sampler. I don't know what this is. I think, I think it looks Guy good. Guy who shows up to golf course in jeans. I don't know what it is. You're making but. it work. And if you want to see him make a lot of people laugh, you can do that at the Brew Haha. -ha. We'll get details up on local12.com. Josh, thanks for coming in. Always good to see you. Great man. to see you, too.